official episode of Cocktails with Cole of the Chill Filtered Podcast. Now, we wanted to do kind of a side video thing that, uh, with Chill Filtered that we could, you know, especially just show people cocktails. Uh, whiskey's great and uh, love it, but there's also other things we can do besides just drinking it neat and with a little water, potentially ice. So what I wanted to do today is actually one of my favorite cocktails and one of the most basic whiskey cocktails in terms of like the top three. I would say, in my opinion, the top three would be um, probably uh, Old Fashioned, a Manhattan, and maybe a Whiskey Sour, um, but other people would disagree with that third one especially, but we're going to do an Old Fashioned today. Uh, first of all, you know, I got my, um, got my cocktail shaker, I got some cherries here, I got some bitters here, Angostura, got some ice, got a lemon for the peel. Got my nice glass that Adam got me. I got a peeler, got a spoon, got a jigger, and got a um, simple syrup. Now this simple syrup in particular is two thirds sugar, one third water. So two parts sugar, one part water. So first thing we're gonna do today is pick out a bourbon. So actually the one I'm gonna grab today is the um, trusty Buffalo Trace. This one's not a barrel pick, it's just your standard Buffalo Trace. Typically you'll find it for 26 to $30 at your favorite liquor store if you're lucky enough. Hate to put it that way, but it can be hard sometimes to find. All right, so what we're gonna do today in my, uh, in my little class of sorts is uh, first, we're gonna start with one, uh, no, I'm gonna double it today. We're gonna go with, uh, typically I'm gonna do one and a half ounces of bourbon, but today I'm gonna make three ounces of bourbon. So double this, and we're gonna throw these right in, one, Two. Typically, for a single, I'm going to do two dashes of Angostura bitters, but since I'm doubling it, I'm going to go with four today. And we go like this. One, two, three, four. Some people will do a little more sugar, but since this is three quart, or two, two to one parts sugar, uh, what I do is exactly one ounce for a double, and I would do a half ounce, of course, for a single. So let's put that ounce in there, the simple syrup. Some people will do sugar, and actually that's technically more traditional. I don't involve citrus, I don't muddle oranges, I don't muddle lemons or anything like that. What I do is I just do a peel, but before I do that, I'm actually gonna grab some of the ice and uh, basically almost fill up my glass. Um, that's a little much, so I'm gonna go one down on that. I might even just add my little cocktail cherry. I just grabbed one or two. These are the best cherries in the world I've had. Luxardo, I've had a lot, and these are the best. I'm gonna throw it right in there into my cocktail shaker. And then I'm gonna add the ice to the cocktail shaker. Hopefully it doesn't splash too much. And before I start stirring, I'm gonna get this lemon peel going. Now the lemon peel actually makes a huge difference. If you're thinking of going without it, consider doing it, uh, maybe even a orange peel. I like both options, they're both equal to me. Uh, so I'm just gonna break that off. And then you can do that little spritzy thing where you bend the peel in half or sort of bend it in half and kind of spritz it out of there and just go ahead and throw it in there. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stir this probably for like 10 seconds. Doesn't need to be much more, doesn't need to be much less. As long as you got a stir going on, you kind of incorporate everything together. You wanna say that's it right there, but first you gotta, you gotta pour it right in, so. Boom, cherries go and we are done. This is, in my opinion, the best old-fashioned you can make. And I've tried a lot, had a lot of sugary ones. I've involved Brandy Adam, um, and it's not good. It's not great with Brandy. So thanks for joining Cocktails with Cole this week with the uh, traditional old-fashioned Cole style. Um, we'll see you guys next week on uh, Chill Filters Cocktails with Cole.